This is Huntington Research Centre, owned by Huntington Life Sciences. They are Europe's largest contract animal testing company. This is the Beagle Unit, where in 1997 an undercover investigator worked for a period of 10 weeks. The footage she took led to the Home Office suspending Huntington's licence to vivisect, to the prosecution of two animal technicians and a substantial drop in their share price. Ex-workers have informed us that the following scenes are not isolated incidents, but are in fact an everyday occurrence. Shit. Can't find a day. No. The word. They're too young. They are eyes, aren't they? The dogs are too young. Too young for the brains are too small. Mm. They're nice and still. They're nice and still, sweet girl. Oh, shut up. Well, I shouldn't sit back too far. He's pissed everywhere. You better shut up. Fucking sit still. I've got He's the patience today. I really have them. Now settle down. Oh, oh that's about, dog. Just have a shake. Oh. Right. It certainly does. Ah, oh, get out! I'm really getting... Many of the substances tested by Huntington have already been tested elsewhere. Beagle dogs are used because of their passive nature and unwillingness to bite. At their New Jersey laboratory, shown here, similar acts of cruelty were also taking place. This dog is obviously fitting and in distress. The supervisor instructed the investigator not to report its condition. Copies of this footage were sent to all of Huntington's clients, including Glaxo Welcome, Jenica, and Smith and Nephew. Many of these vowed never to use Huntington again. Don't hit me with him. Oh, these technicians that. clearly enjoy their work. There's like no skin here to touch. Well, I know. Huntington was cited by the US Department of Agriculture on five counts of breaches of animal welfare laws. On this occasion, Huntington managed to buy themselves out of trouble. Thank you.